What's up guys, it's Matt with Galaxy Games 843. We're back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look here at our new combo vending machine for the barbershop. As you can see, this is a Winter 3589 combo vending machine. But as you can see, it's currently vinyl wrapped with the healthier for you vending uh, stuff on there. So I took a poll on the community tab and I said, should we leave the vinyl wrap? Should we remove the vinyl wrap? Tell me your thoughts. And, and, and you also, all the viewers out there, put it down in the comments if you think we should remove it. Ultimately though, I'm in agreement with the, with the community tab poll. Over 75% of the people said remove that vinyl. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do quite a few things to this machine to get it ready. I've already tested all the motors, everything's good there. So we're gonna remove the vinyl. We are going to put a credit card reader right here in this credit card reader spot right there. Um, some other things we got going on, as you can see, the shop is so full of machines right now. We've got that Mario Brothers back there. We got this Miss Pac-Man, we got Galaga, we got this other combo vending machine, which we're gonna do a video about in the future. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, guys. We've got lots of great stuff coming your way. We've got a Miss Pac-Man cabaret. There's a Dig Dug back there in the back. I know you can see my reflection there, it's all good. All right, so what we're gonna do in this video is we're gonna start getting this Wit Wittern 3589 combo vending machine ready for the barbershop. Because as you know, we've been looking for the right deal for a machine for months. And this one is just so cool, guys. Let's take, let's open it up. Let's take a look inside. Let me grab the keys here. We're just gonna pop this thing open and we're gonna take a look inside the machine. So here we go. Here's the inside of the machine. As you can see, it's got a bunch of spots in the top for snacks and a whole nother section down here for drinks. Now, obviously I just had a couple uh, Mountain Dew cans in there to kind of do some tests with. Like I said, I tested all the motors. I made sure everything was good and functioning. Of course, things are gonna need a good cleaning, of course. So we're gonna do that. Um, but yeah, guys, in this video, we're gonna start by removing the vinyl from this machine. And to do that, all we're really gonna do is take a heat source and start peeling the vinyl away. So we're gonna start it off right here on the side of the door. And let's see, let's see what I wanna do here. I know that's kind of a weird angle, but it's gonna to have to work. So what I'm gonna, all right. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take a common hair dryer because I do not have a heat gun. I just got a common hair dryer. And this is Mrs. Galaxy Games' old hair dryer. She got a new one, guys, so I'm not stealing her hair dryer. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna start heating it up and then pulling the vinyl away. So let's, uh, let's, let's do a little test piece up here. Okay, let's try this again. All right, so you can see the heat and just uh, a little pressure works pretty well. And it doesn't look like there's a lot of adhesive back there either. So it looks like it's gonna be a nice kind of a uh, textured finish. Uh, so we're gonna keep working on this to get this, uh, this, this machine should be all black. We're gonna keep working on this and we'll, uh, we'll check back after we get some more vinyl removed. So stick around guys and hope you enjoy this video. All right, here's just a quick check-in. It's only been about five minutes worth of work and we've already got the top half pretty much peeled off. This is uh, the heat and just kind of elbow 
grease pulling on the vinyl is actually working really well. And look how beautiful this machine is. This vinyl protected this machine. It looks brand new underneath the vinyl, guys. So we're just gonna keep working on it. We're just gonna keep pulling vinyl off and we'll, uh, we'll check back in after we make some more progress. We still gotta do the sides too after we do the front. And I'm not, I don't think there's any on the top or the back. We'll check those too, but we'll, we'll just keep working guys. Hope you're enjoying. All right, and just like that, in literally 15 minutes worth of work, we've got the whole front vinyl removed. And guys, this machine looks amazing. It looks brand new under that vinyl. It's just flat black, nothing uh, crazy. It looks really good. I know it's tough to see here on camera with the lights and the reflection and everything like that, but we're just gonna keep working on this. We gotta remove the vinyl on the sides and it's gonna be ready to go. Again, we, we still need to put the credit card reader in. I'm gonna swap out that window up there. I gotta figure out what to do up top there. There's that healthier for you vending window up here. See that there? I need to swap that out with something. But otherwise, guys, let's go ahead and plug the machine in so you can see it all lit up and how cool it looks. There we go, look at that. Beautiful winter machine. It's a 3589 combo vending machine. Snacks up top, drinks in the bottom. It's gonna be great for our barbershop location. So really guys, this is just a quick video to kind of show you the machine, that we've got it in our possession, that we're doing the work to it, we're getting it ready. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and keep on working. We're gonna remove that uh, vinyl on the sides. In the next video, we're gonna do the credit card installation um, because in, the, in a previous video, we did credit card installation on the VPOS model. This one's getting a VPOS touch, so it's gonna be a little bit different, so I wanted to do an updated video for that. But like I said, guys, lots more videos coming your way. We're gonna keep working on this Witter in 3589. We've got this Crane National Combo Snack and Freezer Machine. It's gonna be probably end up going to the Diesel Garage. So more videos to come on refurbing vending machines all that good stuff. Make sure you subscribe to Galaxy Games 843 here on YouTube, guys. We got lots of great videos coming your way. So I hope you enjoyed this quick video, kind of showing you what we're working on. I'm gonna get back to work on removing the vinyl from the sides. We'll probably do one more check-in video before we wrap it up. So like, like I said, guys, hope you're enjoying the video. And there you go, another side removed. Now we've just got one side left and this machine is ready for the next step. Looking great. All right guys, I know space is a little tight and the light is not the best right here. I've had to shift some things around the shop just to get access to the side of the machine. So there it is, that's the last piece of vinyl left. We're gonna take that off and then this machine is now vinyl free after that. So let's get that done. All right, guys, there you have it. All the vinyl is now removed from this machine and look how much better it looks. No longer does it have the healthier for you vending stuff all over it. This machine looks great. It looks brand new. It's all jet black and it's gonna go awesome at our barbershop location. So the next step is to do the credit card reader on this machine, but take a look at it, guys. It is ready to go. So all we need to do is get the credit card reader in, swap out that healthier for you vending uh, window thing there. And it's gonna be your location ready, guys. So that's gonna be it for this video. Again, hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to, sub to subscribe to Galaxy Games 843 here on YouTube. As you know, we're trying to grow and we need your help, guys. So give us a thumbs up, like the video, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and don't forget to share our videos with your friends. 
All right, next video for this machine is installing the credit card reader. So make sure you stick around, guys. There's going to be more great videos coming your way. Then also that combo machine over there is going to get redone in a future video. So make sure you subscribe. All right, with that said, it's time to wrap this video up, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Again, this is Matt with Galaxy Games 843. We'll see you next time.